हाउ एंड वेलकम डिसीजन थियरी एंड वी आर डिस्कसिंग डिसीजन मेकिंग अंडर अनसर्टेनिटी विदाउट यूज ऑफ प्रोबेबिलिटी वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड द पे ऑफ क्राइटेरियन फॉर पे ऑफ क्राइटेरियन एंड नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द क्राइटेरिया बेस्ड ऑन रिग्रेट्स और अपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय द अपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस इन एनी स्टेट ऑफ नेचर इफ the action giving the highest payoff is not taken as decision what can be the probable loss so in this way it is a very simple arithmetic process to calculate to find out the regret or opportunity loss it is always calculated state of nature wise and not the action wise so to find out the opportunity loss or regret we should consider the states of nature and not the action how to find out there are a very few simple steps the first is find out the highest payoff of the state of nature find out the highest payoff from each and every state of nature say in this state of nature s1 12 is the highest in s2 28 is the highest and in s3 40 is the highest okay number 2 what should we do now like after finding or selecting the highest one subtract each payoff of the state of nature from that highest payoff that means after selecting the highest we need to subtract all from it <coughs> the balance or difference is the opportunity loss or regret say in s1 12 is the highest 12 minus 12 the opportunity loss or regret for this particular cell will be 0 12 minus 12 in the cell with the highest payoff of the state of nature the regret or opportunity loss is always 0 opportunity loss or regret can never be negative why because all are subtracted from the highest so there can never be the subtraction like lower minus higher value in each and every cell higher minus lower is there or higher minus higher is there in this case it is higher minus higher so opportunity loss or regret will be zero in this case 12 minus 10 so higher minus lower the difference will be positive in this case also in each and every case so opportunity loss or regret can never be zero and another important point is in the cell having the highest payoff of the state of nature the opportunity loss is always zero so we can understand that we have to write opportunity loss of each and every combination of actions and states of nature separately in another table and that is called opportunity loss or regret table or regret matrix let's find out first of all in case of s1 12 is the highest payoff so we select 12 and subtract everything from 12 in this case it will be 12 minus 12 0 in this case 12 minus 10 2 and in this case 12 minus 8 equals to 4 in the case of s2 the highest is 28 so here 28 minus 14 equals to 14. 28 minus 28 equals to 0, and 28 minus 24 equals to 4. And in S3 the highest is 40. So in the first cell 40 minus 18, 22. 40 minus 32, 8, and 40 minus 40, 0. So none of the opportunity losses is Zero or uh, any negative, and the opportunity loss in the cell with highest payoff of the state of nature is zero. Now what to do? There are two regret criterions, opportunity loss criteria. First is known as mini min, mini min regret or opportunity loss criterion. Mini-min is a term which.
विच इज शॉर्ट फॉर्म ऑफ मिनिमम ऑफ द मिनिमम सो द प्रोसीजर इज सिलेक्ट द लोएस्ट ऑपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस फ्रॉम ईच एंड एवरी एक्शन सिलेक्ट द लोएस्ट ऑपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस फ्रॉम ईच एंड एवरी एक्शन एंड आउट ऑफ दैम सिलेक्ट द लोएस्ट मिनिमम ऑफ द मिनिमम मिनिमम ऑफ द मिनिमम बट माइंड वेल एट द टाइम ऑफ सिलेक्टिंग द मिनिमम ऑपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस ऑफ द एक्शन इग्नोर द एक्शन रादर इग्नोर द ऑपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस ऑफ जीरो बिकॉज इन ईच एंड एवरी एक्शन देर विल बी और रादर देर कैन बी वन जीरो एक्शन एंड मिनिमम रिग्रेट और ऑपॉर्चुनिटी लॉस इन केस ऑफ ए वन दैट इज फोर्टीन इन केस ऑफ ए टू दैट इज टू एंड इन केस ऑफ ए थ्री दैट इज फोर मिनिमम ऑफ द मिनिमम मिनिमम ऑफ द मिनिमम इज टू इन केस ऑफ ए टू so it is advisable for the decision maker to select action a2 that means to start a medium size factory this is minimum minimum of the minimum regret and these are the minimum regrets of each and every action and from which we also selected the minimum now another criterion another regret or opportunity loss criterion is mini max mini max minimum of the maximum minimum of the maximum so minimum is to be selected out of the maximum regret so first of all we have to find out the maximum regret of each and every action please be careful the regrets are calculated state of nature wise but the criterions are used criteria are used action wise okay maximum 22 in case of a1 in case of a2 it is 8 and in case of a3 it is 4 so minimum of the maximum is 4 that is in case of a3 so it is advisable for the decision maker to select action a3 that is to start large sized factory now these are the two opportunity loss or regret criteria but a few things i want to say uh, say first is mini min mini max minimum of the minimum minimum of the maximum minimum of minimum and minimum of maximum are always considered in case of opportunity loss or regret only please save yourself from the confusion between the opportunity loss criteria as well as the pay off criteria in case of pay off the terms are maxi max and maxi min maximum of maximum or maximum of the minimum in case of pay off and minimum of the minimum or minimum of the maximum in case of opportunity loss so in case of pay off the first term is maxi maxi max maximum of the maximum maximum of the minimum maximum in case of opportunity loss or regret the first term is mini minimum of the minimum 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 of the maximum mini max so this are the regret or opportunity loss criteria in case of a decision problem having the information regarding pay off in case of a decision problem having the information regarding cost everything will be different but that 
we shall discuss in separate lecture that's it thank you very much